man in black. Job well done, if I do say so myself. Yeah. <sighs> Once upon a time, there were two orphans, a boy and a girl, left to fend off the world all on their own. Until I took them in. I'm out. I run the academy, a training ground for boys and girls of um, unique talents. So now they have me and each other, and it's cool. They're growing up fast, real fast. He's a prize-winning surfer, a poet, and an expert safe cracker. She knows fencing, etiquette, and explosives. They're masters of disguise, martial arts experts, and fluent in 20 languages. They're Delilah and Julius, and they're saving the world one crime at a time, baby. Good thing we have extra punching bags. The rodeo people escorted Princess Devanshi back to India. She's grateful, Delilah. You thwarted her kidnapping. You mean Julius did. The decoy trick is Spy 101, Scarlet. Wednesday, Kurtzfield got by me. Oh, everyone's off their game now and then, honey. But when you're part of a team and you let someone down... Is that how Julius feels? Well, why wouldn't he? My intuition or whatever, he depends on that. Have you discussed it with him? I can't. He'll just tell me what he thinks I want to hear. Well then, my advice to you, get back in the game. Dig. Martella Moran, international teen tennis star. And this is Martella's assistant coach, Serge. That looks pretty young to be a coach. That's because he's really talented. Um, he had to stop playing because of chronic tendonitis. Word is, since he became Martella's coach, he's been completely devoted to her. <laughs> it is so sweet. <gasps> Can I sit in? A little expertise is always appreciated, man. Martella's just won a big endorsement contract, right? La Plage Cosmetics. She's also been getting threatening emails, and she had a suspicious accident last week on her scooter. <gasps> yeah, the brakes jammed and she was thrown off. <sighs> I read about it in the tennis rags. Uh-huh. Martella's on her way to play at an invitation-only match at the Gemini Tennis Club. The organizers are antsy about her safety, so they contacted us about some added security. <gasps> Can I go? Can I go? Maybe she should go. I mean, I don't know that much about tennis. You'll learn enough to go undercover, Natch. Which means? I mean, like, how's your backhand, man? <laughs> mm. Very nice. Yeah, but a mixed doubles team? You two will be playing professionals. Come on, so what? Academy training puts us right up there. And the rest? We fake. Here's your racket, darling. It doubles as a stun gun. And these have mini rocket boosters in the heels. They activate by twisting your belt buckle. Oh, I wish I was on this assignment. Me too, Ursula. But you're not, okay? Oh. <laughs> what was that about? Wow, D, you gotta check this place out. D? 
Lila. Advanced tennis strategies? If you train your mind to read your opponent's intent, you can anticipate his shots. Al, Scarlett, and the academy coaches said we're almost good enough to be pros. Real pros. Yeah, but, you know... Whoa! Looks like the captain's gone AWOL. D! Get a look at our friend? No, but I got his jewelry. Uh, Al's put an international trace on the medallion. So far, there's nothing. Care for an old do? What are you doing here? I bugged Al so much that he finally let me come along as undercover backup. <laughs> so many tennis stars, I don't know who to serve first. Oh! I said serve first. <laughs> I'm gonna use that again. <laughs> I hope she remembers we're spies and not tennis groupies. Guess Al had his reasons for sending her. Come on, D. Since when do we need backup? Martella. From Ursula. Martella, what do you think your chances are? Martella is feeling in top form, absolutely. She will win the Gemini Cup, I assure you. Unless I steal it away from you. Huh, Martella? <laughs> Come on, it's showtime. I'm all for you and your Julius. Julius Vanderhill, I'm here for the mixed doubles match with my partner, Delilah. <laughs> I'm into surfing. Enchanté. You are new to the circuit? Yes, we've just qualified, actually. I read about what happened with your scooter, Martella. It was an accident. Uh, completely, that's all. Tabby Renfield. She's the one behind this accident. Serge, please. If you'll excuse us, I have a spa date. Ah, I got Tabby Renfield's autograph! Ah. Could you not blow our covers, please? Sorry, but she is a legend. She even has her own perfume line. She's also Martella's chief rival, remember? Those two hate each other. Do you want me to check Tabby out? No. Mind if we warm up together? <laughs> Queen of the courts! But you're no slouch, Delilah. Not many women are willing to take me on. Except Martella, of course. That sourpuss. They think I'm behind her accident, but that's hogwash. If anything, I've been trying to help her. <laughs> you, you have? Where'd you get this? I, uh, have to, um... Ah! Delilah, do you copy? I found out Tabby was up for the same endorsement contract as Martella. Yeah, well, Tabby just saw the diver's medallion in my tennis bag and looked scared to death. Scared? Are you sure it was fear? Tabby could be covering. I have a pretty good vibe from Tabby, but my vibe could be all wrong. You're doubting your intuition? <laughs> Excuse me, the massage room door. Someone's locked it.
got it. <laughs> Look out! I'm gonna phone in that plate number. I had nothing to do with him. You're lying. This was in the massage room. Recognize the scent? It's your perfume, Tabby. Oh, what's it got to do with you? And these emails, sent a few days ago, all warning Martell off the endorsement contract. She's jealous, she'll stop at nothing. Oh, you'll be sorry, you hear me? Real sorry. No! Can you stay with me, Julius, until the match? I don't know who to trust anymore. Serge. I was hopeless in the massage room. No wonder she trusts Julius more than me. Everyone slips up, Serge. Believe me. You are very kind. And very pretty. Uh, I... I have to... call my dad. Rental cars in the name of Gunter Brine, an alias for Michelle Varand. He is an international playboy linked to a secret organization. And dig this, Tabby Renfield is his girlfriend. So my vibe was way off. Okay, what is going on with you? First, you think it's a good idea having Ursula around, and now it's all about doubting yourself. What's going on? For you, from Serge. Oh, and there's a note attached. Oh. Thanks for being so simpatico. <laughs> Ooh la la. Aren't you getting distracted, Delilah? I mean, you are on a job. Um, Julius, are you ready to hit some volleys? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Hello? Delilah, it's Tabby Renfield. Can you meet me right now in the indoor tennis court? And come alone, okay? Um, sure. Delala, do you copy, love? I copy. We just got new info on La Plage Cosmetics. It's a front, run by Michelle Ferrand and his secret group. Huh. Well, Tabby Renfield wants to meet with me. Be careful, kitten. These people play rough. <laughs> Tabby? <laughs> games with you. Stop the tape at once. When was this, Serge? I don't know. Before the accident. We should take this to the authorities. No, wait. Good game. <laughs> Maybe I should be your partner. Well, you haven't seen Delilah play. How about a ride? Um... Oh, the brakes have been fixed. But sometimes... I just don't know when to stop. Julius! Oh, great. Why are you so upset? The necklace was a gift from La Plage Cosmetics when Martella signed her contract. Martella's not who you think. not who she seems. That's true. But neither am I. We're a spy team, just like you. And you'll pay for that knowledge with your lives. <laughs> <laughs> the ultimate spy experience. <laughs> you work for Michelle Ferrand, don't you? Yes, as you saw on that tape. The Gemini Cup contains a secret formula in its base which alters the DNA structure of top athletes. <laughs> they become killing machines, crossing the globe for sports events, but secretly programmed to do Michelle's bidding. So Martella has to win her match. 
It's the only way to get the cup out of the country. Precisely. Oh, and as a bonus, Martella gets a million dollar contract. We tried to discredit Tabby and get her to withdraw by staging my accidents. You see, the match is by invitation only, so... So, if Tabby withdraws, you automatically get the cup. We'll find a way of neutralizing her. Don't worry. Oh, look! The tide's coming in, and you're going out! <coughs> oh, Delilah. Another time, another place. Who knows? Come on, lover boy. Ugh, creep. You and Serge, are you really simpatico? <coughs> My intuition may be off these days, but I can still tell a slime ball a mile away. What's with you and your intuition? Well, since the rodeo, you know... <coughs> You've been doubting yourself since then? Why didn't you say anything? I didn't know what to say. <coughs> <coughs> but right now, I kind of wished I'd figured it out. I was way off my game, Julius. <coughs> Hang on. I think the water's loosening the sand enough for me to... <coughs> reach my rocket boosters. Can you do it? I think I got it. <coughs> Wait, no! Firing rockets packed in sand will blow us up! Uh... <coughs> can you reach that driftwood? Uh, I can loosen the sand a little more. <coughs> I think I can get my hand out. Out! Yeah! <coughs> So, uh, what game were you off exactly? I... I'm not sure. I don't know. All right. Let me tell you something about intuition. Mine tells me I can't do anything without you. It tells me to find you first thing every morning and make sure you're okay every night. It tells me I can't even make a decent cup of coffee without you. Yeah, that's true. You do make terrible coffee. <laughs> Ursula, what's the score? It's tied. Anyone's game. Look. Surprise development, Tabby Renfield appears to be conceding the match. Follow Tabby, make sure she's okay. Heads up! Ugh. that endorsement contract by Michelle. But when I found out what a jerk he was, well, I broke up with him. So he offered it to Martella. I tried to warn her off through those emails. Which you had to send anonymously to protect yourself. 
Exactly. But then when I saw her medallion, I knew. Those are worn by Michelle's secret group. When I saw the one in your tennis bag, I didn't know what to think. I left that tape as a test to see whose side you were on and expose that witch, Martella. Now, talking about exposure, you aren't really tennis players, are you? <laughs> your ride's here. No. Oh, give him a kiss. <laughs> Congrats, kiddos. You were like champions on this one, so I'm giving you a couple of days R&R. &R. Oh, it couldn't get more perfect than this, could it? Mm, it's great, but perfect? Not quite. Ugh. Um, could I have another smoothie, please, with, like, um, a little less pulp? <laughs> <laughs>